we are going to blow that up later. I'm sorry we fought. <sighs> what we saw will set our cause on fire. Yes. My broken heart can't even process it. Lexi, can you give us a minute? Sure thing. But go gentle. She's in a fragile state. Did she just call me frail? Fragile. Jal says you're a pathfinder from the Milky Way. Do you feel up for a talk? Ah, so now you value what I have to say. I feel for you, but I don't regret my decision. Then your sympathy no. is empty. So, the facility, what's the purpose of all that? They call it exaltation. They believe that those they exalt are given a great gift. Gift? They snatch us, defile and shatter us. All the ones we love, I, I... I can't. It's a complex genetic construct, an interchange of traits that the Ket use to advance their species. So they steal genes, but why? Reproduction. Domination. Tyranny. Annihilation. Yes, and yet... The Archon didn't take me to his ship to transform me. I hung immobile, tormented, never sleeping, brought to him on a whim. He showed me Remnant tech and beat me when I wouldn't speak. Oh no. Remnant, of course. He's obsessed. Like you are. Yes, Jal told me. You rescued me hoping to get into Aya's vault. My people have traveled so far. We'll die without a place to settle. These remnant vaults may be the key. A key to help both our species prosper. I feel for your people in a way that you clearly do not for mine. But emotion must never get in the way of science. I'll take you. Thank you. Yes. Thank you, Moshe Sefer. I'm happy to answer any other questions for you, Pathfinder. Anytime. Oh my, a bunch of codex unlocked. So Jal probably supported motion my decision motion I did not. And <laughs> I capped the uh, kit cardinal. How's Jal doing? Thank you for Cardinals. Information on the Scourge.
Live everyone else up. And Liam. Just need to rest up a bit while I recover my strength. I level up again? Take other species' genes. Asari, take other species' traits. PB, don't tell me we actually agree on something. Changed my mind. They're nothing alike. <sighs> Ryder, exaltation? I never imagined we were fighting Angara. It kills me to think about it. We have to stop the Archon, whatever he's up to. The more we learn, the more I realize how much bigger than me this all is. It's humbling. I have to admit, when you invited me to your apartment, I thought you might be luring me there for... something else. You thought, or you hoped? I might have been hoping. That hope had crossed my mind as well. If Kalinda hadn't intruded, who knows what might have happened. Thanks for chatting. We'll talk again later. You know it. Going through the readouts from the cat facility. I've never seen such advanced genetic technology. Frankly, it's light years ahead of our capabilities. How did he get into medicine? My mom was a dancer on Omega. Dad was a bouncer. I'd patch him up after busy nights. Discovered I had steady hands. They put every credit they earned into my education. Are they here in Helios? No. Both died in a That's turf a war. Made leaving the Milky Way behind easier. I ran across another memory fragment. Dad made Sam for Mom. To cure her. I knew that was part of it, but... You didn't know it was the driving force? He gave up everything trying to save her. You didn't realize how important his family was to him? I guess not. Maybe that's what he wanted you to see. I saw another of Dad's memories. I was in this one. Scott, too. We were home visiting. Dad told us about going through the Charon Relay. So you got your sense of exploration from your father? We joked it was in our DNA. Then that part of him lives on. I'll let you get back to it. I'll be here if you need me.
Ah, hey. Your team's back. Woo! Another trait. Five chance of success. I should probably talk to Jal. Jal. Thank you for checking. But I'm all right. Don't know if I would be. I have to be. How else do we go on? I may seem tough, but I have a good shoulder. That's kind. You're kind. I really miss my family at times like these. Are you close to your family? I was. Am. My mom and dad are dead. My brother's in a medically induced coma. I'm kind of an orphan at the moment. I'm sorry. Yeah, well... This random collection of Tempest oddballs can feel like family sometimes. Yeah. I never really felt I had a purpose. But here, I do. What about the Resistance? My place in the Resistance is not what I'd like. But that kid on Aya looked up to you. Sure. But you are going to do something important, Ryder. I feel it. This is where I should be. I like having you around. Specifically you. Because of my skill and knowledge? Not really. Because you enjoy spending time with me as much as I do with you. You do? Yes. Not planning You're a moment fascinating at all. And special. And strange. Aw. Oh. Thanks. And I mean it. Check out the other person who was on that mission with me, Korra. They aren't just conquerors or slavers. The Ket turn everything you are to their advantage. Worst kind of enemy. The one that makes you fight your own people. That's what Jal faces every day, now that we know the truth. Friends, neighbors, all changed. And they're loyal to Sweet. what changed them. You're pretty worked up about this. Kandros wants strategies for handling the Ket. I talked with Drac, putting ideas together. Expand our guerrilla tactics, get Angaran military advisors, research exaltation. Just, I don't know. Wish your dad could give me his take. Why? This all looks fine to me. Nasira, your father. They always had a plan I could follow. Without one, it's too easy for people to get hurt. Like now. The Initiative's plans are shot, and people die because of it. We're flying blind. It'll take years to put all the pieces back together. Our biggest headache is the Ket. Work goes on, I guess. Sarissa will have a strategy. Just need to find her and the other Asari. It'll be good to have certainty again. All right. I haven't talked to Liam in a while. Just drop off. Nope. 
It won't let me. pretty hard all the time started young smart little kid got angry a lot side effect of giving a shit Liam what's going on we found that facility on Vold. kicked them in the teeth great but the cats steal what people are everyone should have a stake in that also a little something so for I the reached ladies out. Trying to get resources moving in a real way, bridge that gap like I did with Joe. I can't get permission coming or going. The Nexus, Aya, everyone is all can't take risks with outsiders. I didn't come here so everyone could be goddamn outsiders. You're taking on a lot, making all of Helios your problem. It is our problem. We're not going back. We have to make it work. I wanted this. Everything new. But eventually, it... It has to be normal. I need something... familiar. Can I show you something? Did you bring anything... from the Milky Way? One or two things. But the weight limits were real strict. I know. That's why I made arrangements. <laughs> it's a proper petrol burner. 20th century. British. From when that mattered. My whole family works here together, weekends. <laughs> like those are a thing in space. Know what we did? Friends in Hustle set us up good. They borrowed us a transport right before I went into cryo. And me and my father and mother loaded our car into it and pointed it at Andromeda. It's a nice gesture, but you know you won't see it again. Oh, it's, it's a couple million years away at standard light. The important thing is, it's coming. And always will be. I don't know what that means. Uh, I've got a partner. It means your family, the Angara, this team. We're all lucky you care so much. Uh, I'll probably screw it up, Pathfinder. Join the club. The screw-up started 600 years ago. <laughs> Truth. <sighs> this will be home. It has to be. I won't let being outsiders stop that. Looks like pictures of the Exaltation Chamber. Yeah, the Ket are using some Angaran-made medical equipment. Could be a lead. I just want an edge on those Ket bastards. If they ever got their hands on Sid, I'd... Well, imagine if it was Scott. I don't know what I'd do. We're all that's left of our family. Same here. Sid was so little when our father left, and I was... Well, her age now. You raised your sister by yourself. That can't have been easy. Had to. I waited forever for our father to come home. He never did. He was involved with some bad things. Bad people. Eventually it caught up to him. There was nowhere to run. Not like a whole new galaxy. Is that why you came here? When you're young and stupid, you make bad decisions. Piss off the wrong people. That sort of thing never goes away. Not for you, not for the ones you care about. I don't want to not come home one day. Just in case I screw up the PB thing. Come on, you're strong, smart. It'll take a lot to keep you from coming home. Strong, smart, but maybe just lucky. Luck runs out on you. I won't. 
I have a good feeling about you, Ryder. I should get back to work. Talk to my people, see if they've heard anything. Chat later. And animation glitch again. Get the right reset position. I thought I hated the Kep before. Then we learned about exaltation. I can't even begin to imagine how Jal feels about this. I was curious about you and Sid, being on your own from such a young age. Yeah, I really wouldn't recommend it. Where was home? Palavin? No, we'd already left Palavin by then. Whatever our dad was involved in meant we weren't welcome there. I hadn't even gone to boot camp yet. Sid was barely a year old. We eventually settled in a mining colony in the Minos Wasteland. Two years later, our dad was gone. Where was your mother in all this? Back on Palavin, I suppose. She was an awful person. All she cared about was climbing the ranks. She and my dad fought all the time. I think at the end they hated each other. When things were really tough, I thought about going back. But she wouldn't have accepted us. Whatever my dad did destroyed any chance of that. How did he keep you and your sister afloat? I was barely more than a kid myself, so lots of unskilled work. Construction jobs. No one else would do the dangerous stuff, so I would. Being up high, crawling under things. I could shoot a gun, so eventually I moved into smuggling. Even more dangerous, but lucrative. We were never rich, but we got to comfortable. You probably have work to do. We can chat later. You know where to find me. And Gil. Hey there. Hey yourself. Question for you. Shoot. When all this craziness is over, you think you'll have kids? Why is that on your mind? Jill, the best friend I mentioned while I was thrashing you at poker. She's starting the initiative's first repopulation effort at Prodromos. It's all she can talk about. It got me thinking. At the end of the day, this whole thing, the Andromeda Initiative, it, we're basically here to spawn. Took you this long to figure that out? I told you, I didn't really think this thing through. But nothing we do here really matters unless we survive. Jill's right. At some point soon, we better get busy making babies. True enough. Who knew this thing was just a glorified dating service? Oosh. The biological imperative is kind of a bummer. So, you want to have a child of your own? I... I don't know. That's never been a thing for me. I mean, you know me. Whatever my gut says in the moment, I do. And I don't look back. My mom says that's how my dad was. I wouldn't know. His gun moved on before I was born. I had no idea. It must have been hard. Hey, I turned out all right. He did his part. Brought me into the world. Maybe that's enough. Thanks for talking, Ryder. All right, so let's put everyone. So, I'd head back to Aya. Hello. Settle down. If this isn't a good reason to get excited. What's up? You guys aren't fighting, are you? Why would I fight with my best friend? Best friend? Oh, Callo. Callo's very excited about reports nice. I received from EOS. It's good news. The radiation levels are steadily dropping. Your outpost Prodromos is really going to make it. 
When do you want to head back? We could go, but we need to balance our priorities. Why? Just saying, if I created a thriving community in a brand new galaxy, I'd want to visit. Just wait till they put in the beach and the water slides. Now you're just playing with me. So, radiation levels are down. More to explore? Y yes but there's been a rise in Kate activity as well. Figures that we're not the only ones to benefit from the planet's improvement. Might be nice to see how it's doing. Almost like a vacation. Almost. Maybe we'll head back at some point. Well, you're the boss. Just say the word. The obligatory beach episode will have to wait until after we have... Um... Dropped it for passenger. Old orbit is steady. 